All right, dude, that bird was like a fucking... I don't even know what it was. I think it was like a pigeon or some shit. It was just like right outside my windowsill. What the fuck? There's hi guys, welcome. It's it's farther away now, so it won't it won't disturb this amazing ass stuff. So where was he? Was he in the bar? I think he would be in the bar. Where's uh? Do we have a mission to get? Oh, here we go. Garrus, no. Uh. Uh, where's the fucking piece of shit, Rex? We need him. I want my fucking Rexy. Where the fuck is he at? Would he be in CSAC? Oh, hey. Do you desire to learn of the Enkindlers? Or has the honorable CSAC officer enlisted assistance? Are you allowed to preach here in the Presidium? The words this unworthy one speaks are merely observations of the truth. The CSEC officer requests that this one purchase an evangelical permit to spread the truth of the Enkindlers. This is the Presidium, not a church. Evangelize somewhere else. This one's beliefs will not be suppressed. If others wish to try, they are welcome to do so. That Hanar refuses to listen to reason. Why can't it act in an orderly and lawful manner? Because it's a big, stupid jellyfish. <laughs> How can I convince my superior that I deserve a promotion if I cannot convince this annoying jelly to leave? I am not unreasonable. The Hanar is free to spew its nonsense once it purchases an evangelical permit. If you can't solve this problem, you don't even deserve to be in seasick. I didn't ask for your help, human. I can deal with this myself. The CSEC officer states that preaching in this place is forbidden, and preaching anywhere on the Citadel requires a permit. This one humbly submits that it is not preaching to state the truth of the Enkindlers, and thus no permit should be necessary. The CSEC officer is just doing his job. You're causing trouble. This one is too humble to suggest that the CSEC officer is personally biased. This one only wishes to spread the truth to any who will listen. There is no intent to cause trouble. Aw. Oh. Okay. There's trouble anyways, I gotta wait for that. I'll be back. Yeah, I will be back. This one will continue to spread its message. I, I need I need more points than that. Oh shoot, and more fat robot ass. Alright. Uh, maybe it's in CSEC? Med Clinic Markets, Cor Cor uh, maybe it's in Coruscant? Where's CSEC? Uh, I don't know where it is. I mean, I know I know where CSEC is. I'm, I think that's where Rex might be? I'm not sure. Alright, well, we'll go over there first, just because it is somewhere we haven't been. Although we should go talk to the council. Fuck it, let's go. Go find Rex. Trust me, by the end of the episode, we'll fucking talk to her. We'll go find Rex. Uh, Citadel Power Seasick Academy. Here we go. Because I think he's over here. Because I think he gets in trouble or something. I think that's where we're supposed to fetch him. I'm just going based upon rough memory, though. We need Rex, man. Re Rex is our bro. Dude, Rex, Rex and, like... Uh, Rex is like best like crooked waifu, honestly. Alright, everyone, everyone into the elevator. Binary Helix has settled out of court with a Krogan group that had accused the Genetics Corporation of fraud. The Krogan group had contracted Binary Helix to perform studies with a long-range goal of curing their genetic sterilization. The group later sued for a return of investment money when the study produced no viable results. There he is. Ah, I was right. You. Human. You the one they call Shepard? Who wants to know? The name's Rex. The Shadow Broker paid me a lot of money to get rid of Fist. Only you got there first. It's not my fault you were slow on the draw. When I get paid to do a job, I finish it. Alone. I don't like where this is going. But I didn't finish this job, Shepard. You did. So the payment is yours. Bounty hunters don't just go around paying off people who take their contracts. 
I won't take credit for someone else's work. I transferred the payment into your account. I like the way you handled Fist. Now I hear you're going after Saren. I was thinking I should come along. We'll take you with us, Rex. Smart move, Shepard. Alright, let's bring uh, these two. Actually, let's ex examine. Uh, doesn't really do anything. Alright, so we're now just missing one person. Alright, so what's he got? So, here's the problem. Uh, I mean, first aid is pretty good. Decryption is pretty good. I mean, I'm going to go into some decryption myself, eventually. What's he got? Krogan Battlemaster. Oh yeah, baby. Give me that fucking three health regen a second. Alright, so we're going to give him... Warp, Throw, Barrier, Stasis. Yeah, I don't really want to give him Stasis, because they're unable to move or attack, but he's immune to damage. Yeah, screw that. Uh, shield Boost, Unlock Fitness. Increase the damage. Yeah, I think shotguns would be probably the best thing to get into. Uh, also, throw would be good. Uh, I, 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 by the way, this is gonna be one of the main people on the on the squad. Just letting you know that. All right, let's get. Wait, what's this? Advanced warp. All right. Uh, yeah, we'll just do this. Fuck it. We'll get throw next level. All right, so now we got him with us. Uh, is there anyone else here we want? I, I, you know what? Fuck it. We'll come down here later. Let's just go do the, the other stuff. Uh, Presidium locations. Citadel Tower. We need to bring the best team over. <laughs> so far, these are the two best. I may swap uh, uh, Garrus for the last one. I'll see. Because me and Garrus overlap. Udin is presenting the Quarian's evidence to the Council. Why do they always start without me? Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the Conduit. And one step closer to the return of the Reapers. You wanted proof? There it is. This evidence is irrefutable, Ambassador. Saren will be stripped of his Spectre status, and all efforts will be made to bring him in to answer for his crimes. I recognize the other voice, the one speaking with Saren. Matriarch Benezia. Who's she? Matriarchs are powerful Asari who have entered the final stage of their lives. Revered for their wisdom and experience, they serve as guides and mentors to my people. Matriarch Benezia is a powerful biotic and she had many followers. She will make a formidable ally for Saren. I'm more interested in the Reapers. What do you know about them? Only what was extracted from the Geth's memory core. The Reapers were an ancient race of machines that wiped out the Protheans. Then they vanished. The Geth believe the Reapers are gods, and Saren is the prophet for their return. We think the Conduit is the key to bringing them back. Saren's searching for it. That's why he attacked Eden Prime. Do we even know what this Conduit is? Saren thinks it can bring back the Reapers. That's bad enough. Listen to what you're saying. Saren wants to bring back the machines that wiped out all life in the galaxy? Impossible. It has to be. Where did the Reapers go? Why did they vanish? How come we found no trace of their existence? If they were real, we'd have found something. I tried to warn you about Saren, and you refused to face the truth. Don't make the same mistake again. This is different. You proved Saren betrayed the Council. We all agree he's using the Geth to search for the Conduit, but we don't really know why. The Reapers are obviously just a myth, Commander. A convenient lie to cover Saren's true purpose. A legend he is using to bend the Geth to his will. 50,000 years ago, the Reapers wiped out all galactic civilization. If Saren finds the Conduit, it will happen again. Saren is a rogue agent on the run for his life. He no longer has the rights or resources of a Spectre. The Council has stripped him of his position. That is not good enough! You know he's hiding somewhere in the Traverse. Send your fleet in! A fleet cannot track down one man. A Citadel fleet could secure the entire region, keep the Geth from attacking any more of our colonies. Or it could trigger a war with the Terminus systems. We won't be dragged into a galactic confrontation over a few dozen human colonies. Every time humanity asks for help, you ignore us. Shepard's right. I'm sick of this council and its anti-human bull- Ambassador, there is another solution. A way to stop Saren that does not require fleets or armies. No, it's too soon. 
Humanity is not ready for the responsibilities that come with joining the Spectres. It was a Turian Spectre who betrayed this council, and it was a human who exposed him. I've earned this. Commander Shepard, step forward. It is the decision of the Council that you be granted all the powers and privileges of the Special Tactics and Reconnaissance Branch of the Citadel. Spectres are not trained, but chosen. Individuals forged in the fire of service and battle. Those whose actions elevate them above the rank and file. Spectres are an ideal, a symbol, the embodiment of courage, determination, and self-reliance. They are the right hand of the Council, instruments of our will. Spectres bear a great burden. They are protectors of galactic peace, both our first and last line of defense. The safety of the galaxy is theirs to uphold. You are the first human Spectre, Commander. This is a great accomplishment for you and your entire species. I've been ready for this since Eden Prime. We're sending you into the Traverse after Seren. He's a fugitive from justice, so you are authorized to use any means necessary to apprehend or eliminate him. Any idea where to find him? We will forward any relevant files to Ambassador Udina. This meeting of the Council is adjourned. Congratulations, Commander. We've got a lot of work to do, Shepard. You're going to need a ship, a crew, supplies. You'll get access to special equipment and training now. You should go down to the CSEC Academy and speak to the Spectre Requisitions Officer. Anderson, come with me. I'll need your help to set all this up. Bastard didn't even thank you. What do you expect from a politician? Come on. Right behind you, Shepard. Oh boy. Alright. How far can we go? Yeah, dude, let's go all the way. And what's this one? Unity. Uh, we're gonna need that one eventually. Let's do this last one. I'm not gonna put any more points in this, by the way, because I think the rest of them are gonna just go on their own. Uh, which means now we can go talk to the Hanar. You will finally solve the Hanner quest line. You know, priorities. What can I say? Let's do that right now. Let's race down there immediately and tell them what's what. Yeah, that's me putting all the important points into it, all the important shit. The CSEC officer states that preaching in this place is forbidden. And preaching anywhere on the Citadel requires a permit. This one humbly submits that it is not preaching to state the truth of the Enkindlers, and thus the CSEC officer is just doing his job. This one only wishes to spread the truth to any who will listen. There is no intent to cause trouble. I don't care about your intent. You're making all Hanar look like troublemaking zealots. This one does not wish to prejudice the listeners against the Hanar. You Hanar deserve what you get. You're either too snobbish or too stupid to follow simple rules. This one will obey. It does not wish to prejudice other species against the Hanar. This one departs now, and will not intrude upon the Presidium again. I see the Hanar is left. Thank you. Somebody needed to set that thing straight, and it obviously wasn't going to be you. You have already demonstrated your ability. I acknowledge it, and I will learn from your example. Here, for your assistance in this matter. Now, if you'll excuse me, I should report to my superiors. Oh, <laughs> uh, good Omni Gel. Alright, let's check out the, uh... Which one is that? Uh... C-Sec, where is that? Oh, uh, we don't even have a... We can't get down there, unless it's... is it Ward? Oh, yeah, it is. Okay, my bad.
I did not know that's what it meant. All right, so over here, I avoided it for just a, a minute because I knew what this was. It's special shit. It's scanning keepers. One sec, looking you up. Commander Shepard, here with the Alliance Military. First time on the Citadel, that about right? Who wants to know? Just checking for CSEC records. I can only sell goods to authorized personnel. So, will you be purchasing anything today, Commander Shepard? Show me what you've got. Sounds good. Just let me set you up. Oh, this must be a mistake. System's telling me to offer you our select stock. Spectre? Well, I heard about that, but I didn't realize it was you. Sorry, Commander. Just show me what you've got. I'll open the rare stocks for you, Commander. Enjoy. Here we go. So we can get the license for this place, just so we can get it. We don't have to actually come back here and, uh... Uh, what's all this stuff? Limited. Solaris. Amp, okay. Uh, we got light armor. Oh, here we got Reaper 3. Do you know who the Reapers are? Uh, I mean, Stinger 4. Uh, might be good eventually, but yeah. We're gonna have to work on that. I just want to come down there and get that. Is there anything else that we want to have a look at? I, I, I don't remember. Welcome to CSEC. Alright, <laughs> just Codex. What is this place? Oh, towards? No, no, no. We don't. We don't. We, we don't want to do that. Just wanted to have a look, a quick look around. Otherwise, we'll just go back to the embassies. Okay, Jaleed. Let me get this straight. Your business partner, Shorban, he's threatened you. Well, no, uh, not exactly. But he wants to meet with me. I think he's going to kill me. And why do you think that? I... I can't really get into the details. But Shorbin will kill me if I leave here unprotected. I can't help you. Not unless you give me something more to go on. I... I can't. I'm sorry. Hey there! Oh, you're not CSEC, are you? Did you want something? What were you trying to explain to the officer before? My colleague is trying to kill me, and I thought we were friends. How do you know he wants you dead? He's changed. He won't talk to me at work anymore, and he started following me. Yesterday, he followed me all the way home, just waiting for a chance. I don't care what anyone thinks. He wants me gone. I know it. Is there something I can do? Talk to your friend, maybe? Would you? That's all I want. Someone to talk to him. Tell him to leave me alone. He thinks he can just push me around, but you'll show him, won't you? Just tell me where he is and I'll go find him. Oh, right. Well, he wanted to meet with me down in the wards near the markets. He said he just wanted to talk, but I know better. His name's Shorban. He's a Salarian. You shouldn't have any trouble. He's just a scientist. Shorbin. That's the guy who wanted us to scam the Keepers. The Keepers? Well, even more reason to go after him. That's against regulations. If I find out he's lied to me... Anything's possible with Shorbin these days. Well, good luck! Yeah, how does Garrus know? He wasn't even there for it. Hello, Commander. Oh, hello. I can just carry Garrus pops in. Yeah, that's the guy. I know him. He asks us stuff. I used to have an office here. Spent half my time doing paperwork. The encryption skill too low. Uh, it's up to Garrus. But really, we have we have a medium one. Damn, we may we actually may need uh, Garrus for a while. I didn't realize that he would be that important. All right, let's let's use some other weapons. This is the shotgun. This is the machine gun. Just gonna tap some thing. Oh, here we go. 
scan some keeper booty <laughs> while we go on our way to talk to the guy that uh gave us a bunch of shit. Oh, here we go. Level up. Well, I don't want to do any more of this stuff, but uh, let's let's have a look. Electronics. Is Davening something we want? Uh, they can't use biotics. Fitness gives me health. Increases damage protection by 50%. Uh, th this might be actually a good idea to get. Or we can get, like, more assassination stuff. Uh, or Spectre... Tra oh, no, actually, we want Unity, because we want to be able to bring everyone back. All right, where's this place? Open. Okay, I guess we can't go that way. Actually, one second. There we go. More Codex entries. All right. We'll just kind of spray this around. Is there no, uh... Terminal clearing here. Hi, everybody. Come on, me just passing through. Where's this go? Docking bay. Okay, we don't need that. Guess we'll go uh, first to the uh, embassies, actually. Because we want to wrap up that, anyways. I don't know how much there is for us to do here. By the way, feel free to pipe up and tell me whatever you you want me to do. For if I'm missing something, I'll go back for you know. I, I'm gonna try and do everything, but you know, it's it's whatever. I, oh yeah, I should mention I got all like the DLC and shit like that. So also it's pretty up there. Did you want not want us here? What the hell? Jill had fears. Uh. Oh, we can deliver the information to the reporter. Investigate system. Okay, I guess it, I guess it's when we leave. Then we'll know. Rex. Hmm. I get the feeling they're not used to seeing Krogan walking around up here. <laughs> the Spectre, I can do whatever I want, fuckers. Where's the... oh, there's the thing. Hey. Alright, fine, we'll go to the wards now. The markets, I think, is where he was at. Or actually, it's near the med clinic, at least the reporter was. Oh, well. Does it actually show me on my map? It probably does. I see... I see something on my crosshair. First time I was here, I dropped a bundle in the casino. <laughs> Got so mad, I put my fist through one of the machines. Best place up. Anything you want, you can find for sale in the wards, legal or otherwise. Yeah, I see something. Is it down here? Or wait, what, who's that? Ah, uh, it's Garrus. <laughs> uh, I see something on my map. It's kind of spinning. Oh, there's an exclamation mark. There you go. That should mean something. Commander, I wasn't expecting to see you again. Is there something you want? Drop the act. I want to know what's going on, Shorvin. I'm not sure what you're referring to. My experiments are... We're not buying it. Jaleed told us you've been after it. You... spoke with Jaleed? Then you know about the data? Just tell me everything you know. You boys can go. Looks like my plans have changed. It's not as bad as you think, Commander. Jaleed and I just got a little... over our heads. Keep talking. The company we work for developed an experimental procedure for use in medical scanners. Jaleed and I saw even more potential, so we stole the plans and secretly developed a tool to scan the Keepers. Can you imagine? A tool that can actually get readings from the Keepers? That's what all this fuss is about? The Keepers are almost impossible to scan, and you can't capture them or get samples. They just self-destruct. After centuries here, we still don't know anything about them. Don't you see? We were the first to scan them, ever. You've seen it yourself, Commander. You know we can do it. Why are you trying to kill your partner? I'm not trying to kill him. Jaleed's job was to disseminate our initial findings. But he decided to keep the data for himself. Maybe to sell it. I don't know. I should kill both of you idiots. We lost our heads. 
We just couldn't let an opportunity like this pass us by. Commander, if you'll just continue gathering data for me, imagine what we might learn. And you'll stand to make a bit of a profit yourself, remember? If it'll help further the scientific cause, how can I refuse? Very good. Maybe if you wouldn't mind speaking with Jalid. The data you're gathering for me is useless if Jalid won't help me analyze it. If I have time, I'll talk to him. Thank you. And happy scanning, Commander. Oh boy, here we go. Alright, let's go talk to the reporter. They <laughs> got a little bit in over their heads. What can you say? Alright, we gotta go to the left here. I wonder, I wonder what Rex has to say about the uh, outside. We heard useless Ashley and thing. Talk about it. Hey, let's go. I wonder if there's like another option here. Word on the street is that you've been busy. Congratulations on taking down Fist. I was sure he was a big player in anything going on here. Did you find anything in his office that could help me? These OSDs might have the information you're looking for. <laughs> You've got this files? This could be even bigger than I'd hoped. Here, Commander, for your trouble. I had to kill people for these discs. They're worth more than you're offering. I didn't tell you to kill Fist! But you're right. I suppose that I did ask you to help me, so... Here, this should be more than adequate. Now, if you'll excuse me, I should go see what's on these discs. I got like awfully rapey, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck happened, man? Oh, uh, we can't we can't look out, out into space anymore. Rip. What's going on here? Uh, there's your med clinic. Uh, yeah, I guess we'll either go talk to the guy again or something else. I don't know. <laughs> so everyone thinks I killed Fist, but I didn't. I never properly thanked you for saving me from Fist's thugs, Commander. I don't know what would have happened if you hadn't been there. Stick to medicine. You're not cut out for dealing with people like Fist. That's good advice. Let me take a look at what you have for sale. Of course. Alright. Oh, dude. Medical interface, one health regen per second. Actually, that might not be so bad. I might get that. Or medical, medical exoskeleton. That's all actually pretty good. I mean, it's like just free health regen. Uh, I don't want to buy it now, I think. Oh, it's, it just got 70, actually. It's like practically nothing. What do I have right now in my suit? Uh, okay, we got all, we got a bunch of stuff here. Uh, let's have a look here. Armor. What do I have right now? Shield, re shield recovery. Okay. Well, I'll, I'll probably use it on somebody at some point. I think we get more slots eventually. So what do we want to do now? Let's see. Let's go maybe talk to him. Fucking Conrad. I need to talk to Conrad again. Alright, let's just finish up with C-Sec then. And we'll leave it off. Where was he? Was he up here? I think he was up here. We definitely need to see the epic conclusion of this. Because if I, if I don't do it now, then I won't, I, I won't remember. Hello again. Did you have any luck finding Shorbin? I found out you've been lying to me, Jalid. Lying? Why would I lie to you? You forgot to mention the data about the Keeper. Uh, he told you? I didn't mean for any of this to happen. I was afraid Shorbin would kill me to get the data, so I... Well, I was hoping you'd take care of him. I'm scanning the Keepers for Shorbin. But you two need to stop fighting. You're... You're helping us? But... Well, if you say so. Well, if Shorbin can forgive and forget, then so can I. I appreciate the help, Commander. I better go get that data analyzed. Okay, and then he, he disappears into a puff of smoke, alright. He's a fucking spooky little man. Uh, I guess we're gonna leave it up here, guys. So, uh, you know, thanks for watching. And let's see Rex's ass now. Fuck. It's huge. 
think he actually takes damage though. Fuck yeah. Alright, peace out guys.